Hey guys, Bobber18 here, and welcome back to some more Luigi's Mansion. In the last part, we finished Area 1, and we started on Area 2 a little bit. In this part, we will continue on with Area 2, seeing what's in the store. But first, I wanted to uh, say that I think there's a gold bar in here. Or a heart. Okay, I know there's a gold bar in there, so um, cause I was practicing this route, or I was practicing uh, some of Area 2 uh, earlier today. So I'm just going to uh, go see... Um, see if I can make that gold bar appear. I'll be right back. Okay, let's see if we can uh, get it out of the chandelier. Uh, no. Uh, well, um, I guess one gold bar is not that worth it. Because I know, I know there's a gold bar in there. I swear to God that there is a gold bar in there. Oh, well, we're going to have to come back in this room a little later anyway, so I'll check then. Okay, so let's just move on to the storage room. Storage room, yes, that is what this is called. I did not mean to say it, but there's immediate, there's an immediate speedy spirit uh, that's right here. You want to have your flashlight pointed very high up. Uh, exit the room. Uh, get him, get him, get him, get him. Don't punch me! Oh, yes, I still got it. I don't care if you punch me. I do not care if you punch me. You, f you stupid, you stupid pink puncher. I don't care. I don't even care. Go away. Er, fine, I'll suck you up. Okay, as long as I got all the gold bars, that's that's what that's what really matters. Right. Coins and dollar bills, they can go, they can go die, cause I don't I don't really need them. Oh oh yeah okay. Um, this is a new type of ghost. He is a um, he's a grabber ghost like the white ones that we fought earlier, except he's red. The red ones will uh take away some HP if they grab you, but uh, don't let that happen. <laughs> uh, no no no, go away go away. Uh, see, yeah you, to get them what? No, 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 stop it! No, Luigi, stop checking things! I don't want you to check things and say, huh? Just to say check... Just to say check things? No. You go away. Ooh, coins. I knew there were coins in there, actually. That's why I checked it. That's why I was trying to check it earlier, but these stupid ghosts maybe not. Because I'm pretty sure they only appear when it's dark. Okay. Now, when you clear the ghosts, all the ghosts in this room, you might be wondering to yourself, uh, well, what do I do now? Well, if you look in the mirror very closely, if you look in the mirror, you can see... Well, you can't really see it that well. But see, uh, there's like a thing in the mirror right there. It's right here. Well, let's press the button there. And oh no, the wall! Ah. The mop fell. That's kind of funny. Even though it kind of looked like it defied gravity there. I mean, like, it sort of fell in slow motion. Uh, I guess there's more to this room than meets the eye. Ew. Now you might be saying to yourself again, well, what do I do now? I mean, there's this cage on the bottom here, but there's nothing really special about it. And then there's this, like, black ghost in the cage here with the danger sign on it. Well, let's pull it off, because I like terror. I like tearing things off the wall. And there's another button here. Ooh, let's press it. Button. Oh, wait, what did I do? Did I open the freezer? What? What is this? Oh, my God! It's booze! No! No, I did not mean to do that. Oh, shoot. Booze. No. No, this is like the worst possible thing that's ever- King Boo? King Boo? Really? Really? Where'd you go? I wanted to capture you. Please? Please come back? I didn't mean to scare you away. Well, yeah, I'm fine, but I let the booze all go. They're the ones that released the paintings from your gallery? God. They must be even harsher than I thought in the beginning. Yeah, guess they're in the freezer or whatever that was. I don't know. That's kind of a weird cage design too. I mean, like four triangle pieces. Who, who would think of that? Guess this mansion had a very good architect. I'm tickled you found them. See, that that just ex that just if that doesn't show how unique you e Egad is with his sayings, then I don't know what it is. Well, yeah, I probably shouldn't have let all the one out at a time, but I didn't really have control over that. They just sort of rushed out, you know, like water under a bridge, except that's not what you were saying. You were saying water isn't a under... Never mind, I'm not going to try to explain it. Yeah. Well, Mario... Mario probably did get taken by the... Why would they eat him? I wasn't thinking that. <laughs> Apparently, you have a very strange mind, Egad. <laughs> what were you thinking? Oh, when they grow in, when they travel in numbers, they power grows. Oh yeah, well Mario is usually pretty super, but I guess like 
a lot of booze could overpower him, I guess. Oh, do I have to? Oh, I guess Luigi's head nod c confirms it. <sighs> okay, so now we have to go find find one, uh, each one by one. Ooh, a secret function, eh? Secretly? The boo radar? Well, uh, well, gee, that sounds pretty handy and very convenient. <laughs> I mean, it's not like you probably had it already. Wait, wait, yeah, I did. You just said that. I mean, like, it seems way too convenient, like, to actually be real, <laughs> if you ask me. Yes, I'm going to the mansion. I don't even know why they give you an option in the training room. I can kind of see the gallery if you want to go see the paint, the paintings of the ghost you saw earlier, but we're actually not going to go in there. We're going to um go find the boos in the previous rooms that we were in. Oh, and see that see that blue light on our Game Boy Horror now? That's the boo radar that Egad mentioned. When you go into a room with a boo in it, um, it'll start flashing yellow. And when you get close to something that will probably have that has a a boo or something like a boo in it. It'll flash red. By something like a boo, I either mean a bomb, or there's also, uh, boo balls. Gee, I wonder if there's a boo under here. I mean, it has a lump on it. I mean, what what kind of... What is that even... I don't know. And then it disappears. I guess I still have to shake the tape. Or wait. Is it in here? Is it in here? I, I just checked this! How's it hiding something that I already checked? Jeez. Bamboo. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, and the boos, they also... All their names are puns on different things. It's kind of kind of punny like that. <laughs> that was not funny at all. Yeah, I already explained the hide under furniture. Oh yeah, and you can only find them in lit rooms. Like, you can only, uh, the Boo Radar will only activate when, when they're in lit rooms. Or when you light up a room, you know. You know, I'm gonna see if I, okay, never mind. Wait, I already found a poison mushroom in there, remember? Like, last part, I think? Or maybe it was the part before, I don't know. Okay. Well, there's only three objects to check. Okay, never mind. Bootha. What does that even mean? Bootha? It's a pun like on Booth? Or maybe it's Bertha. Like a pun on Bertha? I don't know. Yeah. And after you capture a boo, Egad will give you the chance to save, so that's pretty good options to save throughout the game, and I would like that heart. Because I kind of took some damage there. I wasn't even really paying attention where I took damage, so... I guess that just proves how empty-headed I can be sometimes. There's only, like, three things to check in here, too, but I guess I got it on the first try again, even though it wasn't the thing flashing. Game Boy Advance, a pun off my favorite handheld system ever. Yeah, the Game Boy Advance, if you didn't know. Yes, uh, there's, um, there's not booze in outside places like, uh, this where the toad is, so you don't have to worry about that. Oh, still remember those plants out there. Still remember those plants out there. Just saying. Is there anything in here? No, okay. I'm not going to take the mirror shortcut back because I think it will actually, well, it, I think it might take longer than just, um, than just going the way that I'm going, although it might be a little shorter. Yeah. Oh, and I never mentioned to reset a room, you have to go into, um, two rooms other than the room that you're in to reset it. You can't just go in a, a room right next to it. I don't know why they made it like that, I guess to give it more time to reset, but I don't know. Is there anything in here? Okay, no. Just a bomb. I still want to show off the boo ball. It's kind of funny. It's like a ball shaped like a boo, if you couldn't tell. And who would have thought that, that that ship in a bottle would be checkable? I mean, really. Oh, ugh. Okay, that's something else I should mention. Boos can also go through walls. And this should not have happened to me this early, because these boos only have like 30 or 50 or so HP. Later ones will have like over 300 or stuff like that, which can be really hard to get them in one room. But I don't know. Maybe it's just because I fail a lot at Mario games. Even though some people don't even consider this a Mario game. I don't know why. I mean, how is this not a Mario game? It has Mario characters in it. Maybe it's because Mario isn't in it, isn't in it till like... I don't know. Never mind. Well, okay. And we got five boos now. And once you get five boos... Egad will say, yes, we already got five booze. And he will tell us to go to the washroom to splash some water on our face. And before, the washroom's the room right next to the bathroom that we were in in the last part. Um, but it was locked before the washroom was. Uh, but apparently Egad saying that phrase um, to, for us to go to the washroom, like, magically unlocks it. I don't know how. And there was nothing in there. Ooh, no, bomb. 
Jeez, I want to show off the blue ball. Come on, it's funny. Uh, is it in here? Is it in the tea table? Oh, and something I, else I didn't mention in the last part. When we were fighting Chauncey. Chauncey's a boy, right? So why is his room, like, all pink with frillies and, like, a tea table and a heart-shaped table and chairs and a heart-shaped picture of him? I... And... And... I, I don't know. Did they like plan on him being a girl in the fir in like the beta version? I I don't even know. Well, a shortcut to get back to where we want to go now is to go into the master bedroom and then uh, just uh, check the mirror here. To and we'll warp back to right where we want to go, which is area two or the start of area two, whatever you want to call it. You know, I never checked this pot. I never checked a lot of these pots. Well. I'll check those ones. There's another one down there later, but I'll check it later. Uh, yeah. So we can also go back in the ballroom and the so and the storage room and get booze in there. And that's all the previous booze that we've gotten so far. Um, there's not booze in the bathroom or washroom or any small rooms like that. Because I guess there wouldn't be enough room to for, like, you to have a big chase with him or something. I have no idea. Boo-la-la. -la. Like, ooh-la-la. -la. That's... Wow, these boos... I, I don't even know. They're like... I don't know. Okay. Uh, can I get the gold bar in here, please? No, I don't want a heart. Fine. Never mind. Just take my heart, even though I don't need it. And I didn't even pick it up, because I didn't need it. Is there anything in these boxes? Yes. Game Boo. Oh, we already had one named Game Boo Advance. We don't need a regular Game Boo. Actually, I can't remember if there's like one called Game Boo Color. That would be all three Game Boo, ga all three Game Boo systems, wouldn't it be? Well, I guess except for the Game Boy Advance SP or the Game Boy Micro, but those systems, they're basically just Game Boy Advances except modified, but you know. Okay, I also want to try to get something that is uh, s uh, a random golden mice that appears in this hallway. It appears like right in front of uh, this room right here. And if you hear, if it appears, there'll be like a da 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 sound sound effect, like a really happy sound effect to tell you they got it. Ooh, coins! All they sp splatter all over the place. Okay. And for you to get a golden mouse, you don't have to go in two rooms to reset it. You just have to go into one room. It's like a twenty percent chance, and you get it. Oh, oh my God, I got it there. Yes. Um. That's like one of five random golden mice, I believe. There's five golden mice and five cheese mice. I explained the differences in, the, in like the first part, I think. But yeah, I got all their money, and now let's go to the washroom, finally. I mean, jeez. Uh, anything in this pot? Ooh, a f floating candelabra. Seems kind of random, but okay. Oh, I guess I should- I could explain the- ugh. I guess I could explain the differences between the blue and the purple mice. The purple- Come on! Really? <sighs> anyway, before I was so rudely interrupted, the blue mice uh, will only crawl on the ground, and the purple mice will crawl up on the ceiling. Uh, yeah. Oh wait, there's a toad in here. Well, screw the toad, I want to check stuff for money. Yay, money! Dollar bills! Anything in here? No, okay. Well, let's talk to him. Sniffle! Oh, sniffle? I should probably say that. <laughs> uh, I dropped something really important in the toilet. I, I, I didn't mean to. Uh, don't worry about it. It's probably nothing important. Wait, wait, you just said it was really important. Jeez, am I a really bad listener or what? God. <laughs> hey, you're, you're right. No, no point in crying over spilled milk. I suppose I'll just flush that old worry away. Yup, I'll just let it swirl on down to the depths and... Let happiness refill my life? What did I just hear? Well, anyway, if you check the toilet, there was a key that was in the toilet. Good thing Luigi's wearing gloves. Very good thing Luigi's wearing gloves. Uh, okay. Uh, that toad, like all the other toads, you can save at, but I don't really find a need to right now. Uh, yeah, so let's go to that room that we unlocked. Which is way all the way down here, way all the way down here. Yes, that that's a that's a that's a phrase if you didn't know. Okay. Uh, this is the fortune teller's room. Uh, if you want to, you can shine your 
shine your fl shine your flashlight on this for a long time. And then there's a porch ghost that'll appear here, but um, I'm actually not going to talk to her right now because there's nothing we can actually do with uh, her right now. Uh, so I'll explain her and her purposes later. Yeah, so um, what we really want to do is go into this room here. A giant mirror room. Before we do anything, let's check the chandeliers for the money. Go away. Oh, well, these are these are another type of grabber ghosts. They're ones that can only be seen in the mirror, but uh, they can't be seen in uh, the real reality. I get real reality. Yeah, okay. The real the reality part type thing, I guess you could say. Uh, they're a tealish aqua color, I guess. Um, t what is this? Am I explain? Why am I explaining the colors? I don't care. Oh, but a way you can uh, 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 tell if they are here. Instead of looking at the mirror, you can look at their dust on the floor when they appear. Oh, stupid. I'll reappear. Come on. Yeah, okay. And believe it or not, there's still one more type of grabber ghost that we haven't gotten into yet. One or two. I'm not. No, no, there's one. There's still one. Uh, get, get him before the other one gets me. Oh, he was right on me there. I think this is the last pair before the ring lights up. Yay! Uh, big red chests are red, but I'm going to... No, actually, I'll get this first. Just because when we get the boo, it'll save. Ooh, what's this? A uh, metal? Get the thing. Ooh, we got a metal emanating with fire? You would think that would catch Luigi's gloves on fire, but I guess not. Yeah, what do we have there? Hmm. What is it? Tell me what it is. It's, it's, it's fire element metal. Oh, we can use the fire element? Ooh, cool. Ghost. Fire ghost. Yeah, wherever there's fire. Yeah. Oh, a flame. Like on a torch or something like that? Yeah. And then we can use L to expel it. And there's also a gauge that uh, has it like that. So, remember before when you tried to press L, it would just expel uh, this dust type thing? Well now, if we uh, go over to a torch like this, and we suck up a ghost, we'll have a fire, and we press L. If we hold it down, uh, if you hold it down, uh, slightly, you can get, like, a thing like that. But if you, uh, oh, if you, uh, hold it down slightly, and then you tap it in all the way, you'll shoot a fireball. But if you have it down all the way to begin with, you'll shoot a lot out. I just like to do it a little, just so I don't waste it. Um, you'll see that this is still, uh, still, um, barbed shut. So, what we want to do is, uh, come on. Light all the candles, hey! And you heard the noise that makes sure that the thing is unlocked. And don't forget to get the boo in here. There's only like three things that can be checked, so... Check it! Check the torch! Check the torch, please! I'm asking you as a kind person! Okay, um... Is it that? Okay, it was pointing to- Oh, that's a boo ball! You can suck it up, like the balls in Chauncey's room, and then you can push it against the ceiling, or the floor, or whatever you want to push it against. And then it'll just expel into, like, thin air or whatever. Okay, I already checked this. How can a boo be hiding in a torch anyway? How does that even work? Kung boo. Yeah, like kung fu. Yeah, I don't need to explain all those, do I? It's probably getting really annoying. And you people are like, stop explaining it. I get the puns already. I probably played this game before. Even though you guys probably don't sound like it. You probably sound a lot nicer. Because you guys are nice people. And, uh, you may be saying to yourself, well, we didn't really get a key in there, so what were you doing here? Well, since we just got our newly acquired fireman, fi fireman, fireman, I was, I was like, I was like combining the words fire and element, I don't know. If we got, yeah, I'm not, that's what I'm going to call it from now on. I'm going to call it the fireman metal. Yeah, since we just got our newly acquired fireman metal. Then we can use it and light the candles, and their key will appear up there. And then we'll get the key to uh, that room down the hall over there. Yeah. Um, but I think that is going to be it for this part. We uh, got our fire mint medal, and we also got a good start on the... on the. We got 9 out of 50 boos. That's a pr pretty good start, if you ask me. So in the next part of Luigi's Mansion, we will go... Um, see what was in that locked room down there as I continue to try to start up this uh, crystal ball. And I will see you guys then.